welcome. My name is April Ray, CEO and founder of the Introvert Mogul Studios. Thank you so much for joining me. Um, so today I wanted to share with you um, a little, a cool little strategy or a cool little way to keep track of your prospects on Facebook. So when you're prospecting and you're talking with people and you're engaging with people, it's really easy to kind of forget who they were or, you know, that you, you, you remember letting, you know, accepting their Facebook um, request and then you kind of forget about them after you talk about them. Well, this is a, or talk with them. This is a really great way that Facebook has where that you can manage a list of the people that you prospect or you talk to or engage with. So this is my homepage. I'm going to go over to actually the um, news feed and we are going to go down to our friends section here. I'll wait for my computer to catch up. There we go my friends section and just hit more and this is where your lists are um, carried over to now you can create a new list and you can give it a name um, any name that you want depending on what it is that you're you're looking to do a prospect for whatever company you're in or affiliate marketing product whatever so you can create your own list there oops let's cancel that um, I've only created three and actually Facebook created all of these. These are just something that they automatically create for whenever you sign, whoever signs up for Facebook, they automatically create these. So how does this work? Well, what you're going to do is, um, first of all, let's go, I'm going to go back to, I'm going to go over to my um, page, my Facebook page, business page, and one of the things that you can do is go to one of your posts, one of them that has a lot of engagements or a lot of likes, and you can click on the likes and just go through, you know, who hasn't liked your page yet, and you can invite them to like your page. Now, once you do that, you can go over to their page. You can actually do that before you go over there. You can go over to their page, right? This is Angela, and she liked my post. Now, there's not a lot of information on here that tells me what she does. So what I'll do is I can add her as a friend. And what I'll do is hover over the friend request that I just sent, and I can add her to another list. So since I really don't know what it is she does, I noticed that she liked you know, the blog or the, um, the Facebook post, which was about branding and for network marketers. So I'm going to put her under the entrepreneur. Well, no, I'm going to put her under the network marketing um, link that I, that I created, the network marketing list that I created. So once I do that, what I have to do now is I'll go back to my home. Now, she hasn't, she hasn't accepted my friend request yet, but I can still add her to my list. So I will go back down to the uh, friends section to more. And I'm going to check network marketing and let's see if we have her in here yet. We might have to refresh it because sometimes it takes a minute. Or did I put her in entrepreneur? No, I put her in. I'm pretty sure it may be that she hasn't posted anything yet. That's why she's not showing up here. But basically, if we hit manage list, here edit list she should be in here Duh. yeah so there she is she's right in there and so now these are the people who are in my network marketing list that I can keep track of um, I can find out what they're basically what it does it helps keep the people that I prospect right in front of me I can go to my list and see what they're posting um, she hasn't posted anything in a while, which is probably why she's not showing up in the feed yet. But my other network marketing um, friends that I've had conversations with are, so I can like their posts because they've posted, she's posted this in the last hour. And so they know that I know that they're there, right? And now they know that I'm here. <laughs> so we bas I basically keep myself in front of them and I can engage with them and keep in contact with them you know just and after a while they're gonna start doing the same for me so what happens with is with Facebook algorithms when you post a lot on someone's post their Facebook is gonna say oh you must like their post so they're gonna show you more of their posts 
And what happens is if they're, if you're liking their posts, you're going to see more of their posts and vice versa. They'll start liking your posts and then they're going to start seeing more of your posts and you'll start getting more post engagement that way. So that's a really great way to keep track and keep contact with your, um, with your prospects. Now, if you've had a conversation of somebody and they seem like they might be really interested, um, but maybe they weren't interested at, at that time, you can always go back, you know, look maybe a couple of days, couple of weeks later and look into your list and say, hmm, what is this person doing? Okay, let me, um, let me send them another message and see, you know, where they're at. Because people, you know, they say people go through changes every six months or something like that, every three to six months. So this is a really great way to keep track of the people that you're prospecting and, and, and making connections with on Facebook. And that's it. That was a really cool trick that um, I heard about a long time ago, but I never really looked into it. And then I saw a training in my MLSP back office and I thought, oh, okay, well, let me go ahead and check it out. And padow, now I, knew, I know something new. And now you know something new too. And you know what leaders do? They learn something new and then they go and they share it with other people. So don't forget to go share with other people. If you want to know where I get all of my training, uh, up to date, cutting edge training of social media marketing, online marketing and network marketing, how I build my brand, how I keep my brand in front of my people and how I attract leads instead of chasing after leads, go ahead and click the link below and um, find out what I'm doing. All right, that's it, you guys. Thanks again for joining me, and bye-bye for now.